This is a project where we did something that we have never done before. As you can see, we stacked the entire stack of containers first. And then we cut the containers. Oh, that's true. Normally you cut them before. All before. The great thing about drive lines, the courtyard and the walkways really create a very strong communal space. Yeah. You know, so the courtyard is something that is in our heads as Neapolitans, you know, it's the life right. of the courtyard, right. it's a mm. very strong thing. It's a very traditional building in a it's way. It's a very traditional mm. building, mm. absolutely. It's when just we, cut. Yeah, when just we, cut. It's a weird thing. <laughs> Your average person's understanding of the power of architecture here is really only in the negative. Mm -hmm. People understand... Oh, things have failed. Things have failed, right. You know, the apartheid spatial planning has failed. The ideology mm -hmm. failed. It's, it's caused immense suffering. It's Especially multiple, you know, multi-housing no. projects. They are the, the heated subject. Really. No, completely. And I mean, when people... Because everything that fails, failed there first. Absolutely. And I mean, people talk about things like social housing. Yeah. Like yeah. here, it has such a yeah. legacy. And how is that change in life? Moving here? Yeah. Marvellous. 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 Very good first place. It's interesting oh, because yeah. when we were designing, the idea was to try to do a place where yeah. young people could move. And oh, yeah. People that were interested in city life. It's mostly young yeah. professionals here. So. Yeah. Yeah. So what's your work? You said you were coming back from work, right? Oh, yeah, no, I'm a doctor. You're a doctor. Oh, <gasps> but it's good, it's good to have a doctor in the building, actually. It's a, it's a complete community, I think, when there is a doctor, yeah. you know? Have yeah, they <laughs> called you? Yeah, Has yeah. anybody called you? Um, in, uh, once or twice. Once or twice. Yeah, it has happened already? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, I love yeah. that. No, you do. Yeah. But they come and knock on your door? Yeah. And... So basically, I used to live in this apartment across there. Uh, so I watched the whole thing right, right coming right, right, up. Right. Like, so oh, you used to live there. in the... Yeah, in yeah the on the fifth floor. So I saw like from demolishing, had everything going up and stuff. Kind of interesting. I was like, maybe it's not for me, yeah, understand? Yeah. Ah, but you ended up making it home and now yeah. we're here. That's and you so like nice. it. Yeah, it's cool. I love it. it. Self-contained, especially now in winter, hitting yeah. it up. And it's so easy, so cozy. Yeah, and it's a cozy it's space. Home. No, I sit here outside, everyone is freezing in there. <laughs> no, this is the best yeah. part. The tables yeah. and the yeah. chairs, the sun is always here. Yeah, it is, yeah, there you go. It's great. Yeah. I thought this is the apartment yeah. I would get because the outdoor is the sun. Yeah. And... A, a really robust and rich and complex place allows multiple beauties, multiple aesthetics, mm -hmm. multiple tastes to exist. Mm -hmm. The insecurity here is very, very deep. Mm -hmm. You know, is this polished enough? Is this European mm -hmm. enough? Is it first world of enough? Is it, you know, all of that kind of, of question course. means that this kind of work is, it takes a while to... Yeah. A lot of South Africans, particularly the kind of educated middle class, are always looking over their shoulder to see, you know, does Europe think that this is, is it okay and we didn't have done things the right way? And I keep saying, you know, the Europe you're looking at left the station 40 years ago. I mean, Europe <laughs> is not like this anymore. Oh, Europe right. is in crisis. Yeah. Forget about them saying you're doing the right thing. They're looking to you for answers, not yeah. the other way around. <laughs>